Well, the cold weather has arrived and we're probably already hearing that popular term polar vortex in the media. The polar vortex is back or it's another polar vortex. Well, the truth is the polar vortex is always there. The polar vortex is a fast moving ribbon of air in the upper level atmosphere over the poles. In this part of the world, it's responsible for keeping the coldest air where it belongs over the North Pole. Meteorologists often refer to it as the polar jet stream. The speed of that air is really important. When it's moving faster or we have a stronger jet stream, the coldest air is contained over the North Pole. But when the air within the jet stream slows down slightly or becomes weaker, that's when it's time to plug in the car and reach for the heaviest coat you have. A weaker polar jet stream will tend to meander north and south, allowing the coldest air over the North Pole to move southward. So it's nothing new, but it might seem like it's happening with more frequency. So why does the air within the polar jet stream slow down or weaken in the first place? Many climate scientists think that it's due to the warming of the poles and that climate change may be responsible for more cold air outbreaks in wintertime.